All right, we get questions all the time about the difference between inspector lab slash priority lab and other labs. And, you know, in the home inspection industry, one of the other labs that has historically, you know, been a presence has been ProLab. Um, no doubt about that. And no doubt that, uh, that they've certainly been innovative, particularly in, uh, in things like housing the House of Horrors, Florida, you know, uh, moving all the, their vacant space from their operations that are shrinking uh, to a, a rental situation with InterNACHI and Nick Romico. And I think that that is, you know, some true innovation. Now, as far as their uh, product is concerned, though, there is much to be desired. And what I, I want to show you here are three air, indoor air quality cassettes and show you a little bit about the, the kind of quality the, that you can expect from ProLab. So this is uh, the, the first example here. This is a Inspector Lab branded aerosol from Zephon. And we were probably one of the largest purchasers of these in the country. Uh, and we're very familiar with them. It's, it's a standard cassette and it, you'll see it says Zephon right there. Uh, I'm going to put it so it's, yeah, readable there. Uh, it says Zephon right inside because they printed this on their plastics. And inside there's a plate with a media that is a proprietary blend of, mm, I'll put it out there of at, as at least three chemicals and uh, components. This right here is the Breeze ST. Uh, now this is the aerosol, this is the ST. This goes for about $5. These things we sell, depending on volume, as little as $3 a piece. And you'll notice, you know, they're exactly the same in size. They're actually very similarly built. However, there is a patented process on the plastics. It's a more secure application. It cannot be tampered with and also makes certain that your lab results are more credible. Uh, you'll also see on the uh, label, there's a, a serial bar and that serial bar is scanned directly into your mobile app from Priority Lab, which makes it so you don't have to write down any numbers. This unit uh, has, you know, some cool features. The sticker, for instance, is super easy to take off for when you, uh, you know, attach it to the pump and then reattach it. So cool stuff there, uh, not sticky at the end of this and, you know, cheaper. But, the, but inside, there is a proprietary blend of, let's call it, at least three components of sticky media. Uh, we've tested it tens of thousands of times, probably over 100,000 times at this point. And if anybody wants to try out the Breeze ST, just send me a message or send me an email and uh, include your address, and I'll send you some for free to try out with Priority Lab. Now, last on the list here is um, a quality product from ProLab. This is uh, also a cassette. Um, now, you know, on this, you won't see any branding of uh, Zephons. And the reason for that, and here I'll show you under underneath the lamp here, uh, the reason that you won't see any branding from Zephon is because uh, we poured this. <laughs> this is plastic injection molding that we do in high volume. Uh, this product, uh, supposedly, you know, made by ProLab, <laughs> is a little different. Uh, they, they have the stickers you can take off. You know, pretty cool. Gosh, I, I wonder where they got that idea. <laughs> but, but let's put that aside for a second. Uh, and let's, let's, let's look at these plastics that were, you know, quote, made by ProLab. Wait a second. Does that say Zephon right there? Yes, it does. And let me tell you why and why you should be pissed off. This is a rinsed off, washed in a dishwasher cassette. It is not a new product. Now, you know, recycling is good. Um, they're with them. Uh, I love the environment. I live in it. And my kids and grandkids live in it. But I don't represent to clients like you that are paying 
full price for media. And in the case of ProLab, actually prepaying for lab fees um, <laughs> as well uh, that, that coincides with the media. Uh, I, I don't represent it as a product I made. And then so blatantly, obviously, uh, be pulling trash out of the trash can and reselling it to you. That's horseshit. But here's the worst thing. The worst part of this, and I'm going to make sure everybody sees this. I'm going to do this one-handed so that, uh, you know, it, it's visible. So it, this is a uh, plate, and there's a plate on this. I'll put it under the, the glass once, once again. So this is the, the slide cover, essentially, that we all utilize because it fits in these, um, uh, in these cassette molds. And it's thin glass. And we take it and we put it on an actual slide to prep it for uh, for our lab processes where it goes underneath the microscope and we count up mold spores. Well, on the inside of these two units, uh, the Breeze ST and the Aerosol, um, on these two, two units, it's a semi-gelatinous liquid. <sighs> This is so depressing. It is so depressing. So I'm going to take this off and make it so that you can see this. Uh, on this, oh gosh, I hope this comes out well in the uh, in the video. I think it will. There we go. Oh, there we go. You see that? You see how I can leave a fingerprint on that? And you see how you have this perfect line of, uh, you know, we'll call it, quote, media across this. It's a piece of fucking tape. It's not technology. It's not something anybody uh, developed. It's a piece of, of tape. And I wouldn't be surprised if, uh, you know, based on the high quality and, uh, uh, and delivery of integrity to clients, if it was tape from the fucking dollar store. And not only that, here, here's the worst part. Like, it'd be one thing. It'd be pathetic if it was only that. But that's not the only issue. The issue is, is that it doesn't collect mold spores. So if you're getting these units and then you're taking a, a test and you're sending it into ProLab and they're coming out with a test for you and sending you a report, um, nobody in the lab business, no qualified lab technician or doctor or uh, lab director in this business, and we discuss it because we have clients that have sent us this crap because they, you know, picked up a free one at a conference or something, uh, and they send it to us, uh, and, and we can tell you one thing for sure: it it does not do, because it's so cool that it's tape. It can, you know, help you to um, wrap presents, but it cannot collect mold spores, and we have no fucking idea what they're counting to put into their reports. So, um, you know, good luck with that. Enjoy. See ya.